Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Namaste. Thanks for joining me again on another Hollow Spill. My name is Matt Hollis. Um, I've been running another Hollis build on YouTube here for probably about the last year and a half. We're trying to reach uh, 1K um, above 800 right now. Hey, please smash that like for me. Subscribe if you haven't thus far, man. Follow me along on this journey. I'd be really, really appreciative of you doing that. Um, click that bell for notifications, man, so you never miss a video. No. But many of you guys know um, that I, I believe I have the world's largest Fernando Tatis Jr. collection. I've got now 338 unique cards i just showed you a video actually it's right up there this is the last day of summer we start back for school tomorrow so i thought this would be a great way to kick it off man thank you guys very much um i'd be stoked if you guys watch till the end some pretty cool cards coming out all right here we go this first one i thought i'd start out with because it's super unique this one right here is a home run challenge winner and that's numbered 303 out of 400. Now, I didn't win this. I actually purchased this one off of eBay. And it says, congratulations, you have received a special prize card from 2021, the Home Run Challenge for correctly predicting that El Nino would hit a home run in May. There it is. That's really, really cool. I'm super pumped to be able to pick that one up. This is what they look like when you uh when you win one of those home run challenge cards really pumped about that it's got a little top that you put up on it right there nice the next one is a uh 65 redux insert but that's the uh, chrome refractor and that one right there is out of top series two i believe pretty cool card like i said i'm going to show you guys 31 unique cards today this one right here is um i believe it's out of the series two this is an insert as well this is the nl all-star tatis jr pretty cool now i've got some significant statistics i like i, I like these inserts this one right here is um 32 barrels which is which is pretty cool barreling up on the ball right there he uh what does it say sabermetricians define a barrel as a well-struck ball where the combination of exit velocity and launch angle generally lead to a minimum 500 batting average and 1.5 slugging percentage wow pretty cool he led the majors with 32. This one right here, significant statistics. This is a hard hit, 95 mile per hour plus, and his says 102. Damn, that is sick. 102 of them were among the 164 balls that he put in play. Pretty cool. This one, oops, sorry about the camera there. Here we go, this is significant statistics, 95.9 .9 miles per hour. Um, that's his average exit velocity, but look at that. It's numbered 194 out of 299. That's pretty cool. I think it's because it's got like the black border right there. The next one is the same card basically, except that it um, has got his bat there. It's got a game used material. That's pretty cool. The significant statistics relic card from series two. Oh, got the superstar duos right there out of the stadium club. That one has Manny on the back and my boy on the front. Pretty cool card. This one right here is the T51 Murad. That's out of the Allen and Ginter. It's kind of cool that it's 23 in a series of 50. 23 is his number. And you know why, right? Has nothing to do with Michael Jordan. Has everything to do with um, the fact that his island is number 23 there in the uh, Dominican Republic. There is the base of the Gypsy Queen. There is the red of the, I mean, <laughs> red. That's obviously not red, that's green. <laughs> the green, I don't know what I was looking at. There is the captain card. I think that this one right here was pulled from BMAX breaks. Big up BMAC. This one right here is the chrome. That one is sick. Super stoked to have that. Look at that. 
Really dope stats on the back. Now, this is out of the museum club. Boom. Or the museum collection, I mean, not museum club. I just said stadium club. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Thanks for being here, man. Hey, dude, smash that like for me. I'd be super, super stoked. Subscribe if you haven't thus far. Um, I'm sure you are, though. Most of the cool people are. Let's see. That is numbered 29 out of 99. That's the purple out of the museum. A lot of these were picked up on eBay. This is cool. This is the uh, 2021 Bowman Keith Shore. I'd like to pick that up. Did not pick it up for 75 cents. Wish I did. Probably wasn't. I mean, it wasn't too expensive though. Look at this. Out of baseball card day, I ended up getting two. Those are pretty cool. dig those ones that was cool to be able to go over to the lcs and pick those up me and lena had a great trip actually it's right up there if you want to see it i got a couple things out of select this one right here is the uh, 25th man i already have the refractor this one right here is phenoms pretty cool insert now this is one of my favorites you guys saw the video um hopefully you did if not it's right up there <laughs> about pulling this scope parallel Sick. It was the very last card that I pulled. I'm liking the select. What? I mean, come on now. What a beautiful card, right? Super dope. Um, this one right here is the red, white, and blue out of select. These ones are not numbered. Well, at least this one's not. It's the concourse. Um, got the uh, absolute base, but this is the foil base out of the, out of the hobby. And I also picked up this one really cool dude this is the blue and that's numbered what 85 out of 149 beautiful looking card there that's what the back looks like how about out of the prism gotta have that gotta have that base prism every year you know i'm gonna try to get his oh you can see me back there in it what up boom and then oh this one right here i picked up off of Ethan's Elvis covers and more got this one in an auction that is what out of uh, 249 128 out of 249 sorry if I got you blinded with the light super dope this one right here absolute heroes oh this is gonna be starting the 2020 okay so I've got some cars from 2020 as well this is uh, the absolute heroes insert what the back looks like pretty cool um these ones right here are going to be gold cups now check these dude this one right here is the uh the gold stars and i believe that that's like a variation that you could get out of the complete sets um this next one big up redskins fan forever dude john cole thank you so much bud he sent me the sepia and it's actually hidden in there i couldn't find it for a couple days but when i did i pulled it out and flip dude super sick after the sepia boom that hyper prism we got that one from uh zero fox boom <laughs> yeah man thank you so much dave super sick this one right here is that commemorative coin this one right here is out of 2020 top series two I already had the update. I believe I've got series one too, but I'll have to check. You know, I try to get them all. This was a really unique card that I found on, um, on eBay. This is Future Stars right there. Fernando Tatis Jr., 2015 International Prospects. Look at that. And that's out of Hot Shot Prospects, 2015. That's pretty cool, dude. And he's out, yeah, you can see right there. That's his island. San Pedro de Macores, Dominican Republic, island number 23. Really cool card. This one right here, psh, one of my favorites. Big up, John Rodemacher. Thank you so much, sir. He got this card made for me. Sent away to someplace in 
Hong Kong or <laughs> something like that and got that made for me. Thank you so, so much, John. That is sick. Dope. So those right there are all the cards that I'm going to be adding to the world's largest. Also, I've got some Project 70 cards for you. All right. Now, well, here, I'll just do it like this. Bam! Check these out, dude. This first one right here is by Par D, and that is, it's got to be one of my favorite. I mean, it probably is my, my favorite, except, well, you'll see one that comes at the end. That's sick. That's the 1989 Topps baseball design. Loving the Project 70. This next one, here you go. Fantastic Padres. There you go, like the Fantastic Four. It's starring uh, Tatis Jr. as El Nino. But it's sick, dude. You've got Darvish, Snell, and Machado up in there too. Really, really dope. Looks like a comic. And that one is based on the 93 Topps baseball design. That's by the, the Shoe Surgeon. It's like tricky to say, Shoe Surgeon. Next one, that's a pretty sick one. You know I pick every single one of them up. That one right there is um, is done by what? Rochester, Jacob Rochester, and that's based on the uh, the what? The '63 tops design. Pretty dope. Is that '63? No, the '83. Why would I say '63? I don't know. I, my glasses just went down. <laughs> Really cool. Check this one out right here. There you go. In his pink suit. <laughs> that one right there is the 59 Tops baseball design. And that's done by Old Man Old Manolin. Really cool. Alright, now here we go. <sighs> this one was super dope, but is even doper. That it came with that, the Rainbow Refractor. I could not believe it. These are randomly inserted out of 70. Um, if you haven't got a chance, check the video up there. Um, you can see my reaction. Sorry about the cam. They're done by Sophia Chang, and this one is numbered 57 out of 70. You can see that right there. Wow, super, super pumped and stoked to have that that in my collection. Have both of them, really, but that one is incredible, super spectacular, and I'm very elated. Oh, last but not least, check this out. I got a box topper. That was pulled from Rippin' for Rookies. Thank you, Mike Post, man. That is another cool box topper to add to my collection. You guys. Have a wonderful day or a beautiful, beautiful evening. Whichever one it is, make sure that you make it great, my friends. Enjoy the beginning of the school year and the whole year long, man. Thank you guys so much. One love and peace. Yeah, man.